It may be raining outside today, but Russell, nothing can stop Furry Friend Friday. As always, we are down here at Lawton Animal Welfare. Thank you so much for taking the time with us today. Well, I'm glad you brought up raining because it's raining cats and dogs down <laughs> here. So, yes, um, it's actually really good weather. It stopped now. It was hailing a little bit ago, and it stopped. So we're expecting more people to come on down here. Absolutely. And speaking of cats and dogs, why don't we go down and introduce a great dog that we have, okay. uh, have a, our special guest this week. Okay. Well, this is Nola, and Nola is a 10-month-old staff female mix she's amazing she is blowing through her coat right now so this white hair is going to get all over the place until she's done with that um, but she is incredible she's super nice now we do have a little bit of issues with like potty training and stuff like that that we're still trying to work on with her but super super temperament you got to meet her and everything so what do you think so far so good she is a sweetheart i love this little spot she's got right on the top of yeah. her head and she is she is just a very very loving dog and oh my gosh is that that's seven news anchor caitlin williams Look, oh my so gosh we have another Whoa. special Whoa. guest hey guys well i just had to make sure will was doing uh, the job correctly and it looks so far he is so good job will well, great, very great good. to hear i'm not blowing it <laughs> <laughs> and so here we have Trey, and Trey is a three-year-old Min Pin Mix. Also, he is super, super amazing. The biggest thing about both Trey and Nala, they're the only two adoptable dogs I still have left in the building that didn't get adopted this week. We had a phenomenal week in adoption. So we're hoping to find these two forever homes to today or tomorrow. And again, that's something else that we're doing that we've never done before. I've always held the dogs until the next day. Today, we're not going to do that because this is the only two in the building. And if they do find Forever Homes today, we're going to try and get both of them out. Absolutely. So if you want these two dogs, you do have an opportunity until 6 o'clock tonight, correct? Correct. 6 o'clock tonight or tomorrow, they can come down. And if they're still here, then adopt them then. And you're also doing something else a little different this weekend you're not usually used to, and that's in terms of uh, get, getting some surgeries done. Correct. We have a volunteer vet coming in. Dr. Lungsford um, is going to come in here, and she is going to perform surgeries on Sunday. That is amazing. That is all done by volunteers, including the people coming in to help us that day. And that is so that way on Tuesday, we will have even more animals up and saving more lives. But we can't do it unless we're doing it as a community like we're doing right now. And that's huge for being able to get space in there as well to get more dogs and cats out to those forever homes. Correct, and positive space. Uh, the, the big talk about euthanasia and always having to euthanize, this is going and doing it through adoption process. The only other thing that they could do better, we discussed last week, was what? If they come down and claim their animal, that's number one. That way we get them back home. Number two is through adoption. Number three is to get the rescues to come in and help us that way. And number four is the worst. And, you know, that's the euthanasia part. None of us want that down here. Absolutely. Well, we had a great surprise with Caitlin coming and joining us. Thank you for Thank having you. me. That is far from the only surprise we have today, Russell. <laughs> you don't even know about this one. We got a birthday boy this weekend. Woo! Happy <laughs> so of course, birthday. we had to get some balloons for you. Okay, I did not know about this one. <laughs> yeah, you celebrate the birthday. Yeah. And so, you know, tell people how they can come out here this weekend to not only help, uh, you know, adopt some of these great pets, but also wish you a happy birthday. Okay, well, we're going to be down here tomorrow from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. And we just happen to be located at 2104 Southwest 6th Street. We'll, we'll see, see you down, down here. here. Make sure to check out Lawton Animal Welfare on Facebook for more information and wish Russell Anderson a very happy birthday.